Hey guys, Josh here with How to Roll Dice. Just a quick video today. I kind of wanted to share something with you that's relevant to my videos, but not necessarily gaming related. And it's actually the fact that I bought a denoiser. It's a 4K Pro denoiser from Neat Video. If you guys don't know what a denoiser is, which you probably wouldn't because it's very camera video focused. Uh, it's basically when I go to do shots, if I happen to get the lighting wrong and things are a bit dimmer than they should have been, my camera is automatically going to try to compensate by cranking up the ISO, which without getting into too much detail is basically how sensitive the camera is to light. So by turning up the ISO automatically, it makes the shot look not as dim as it would be. However, doing that actually adds artifacts to the darker spots in the image. If you've ever seen a grainy video that was filmed on like a cell phone and all of the dark spots in the video look like they have speckles or pixels in it, that's noise, that's artifacts that are generated from the camera trying to compensate for how dark things are by finding light where there isn't any and it creates those sort of speckles, those artifacts. A denoiser can remove that stuff and make it look nice and smooth like proper dark, proper black, proper shadows. Cinema cameras and cinema, you know, photo processing, video processing, they do this all the time. It just takes a really strong computer to do it smoothly. I now have a newer computer, a nicer camera, nicer lenses. I'm always trying to, you know, buy better stuff and add stuff to my ability to make this channel look high quality. Um, and so I wanted to show you guys what this denoiser can do. So here's a quick shot of some models on my shelf. You can see this is shot with definitely not enough light and you should be able to see that this shot looks very noisy. There's a lot of that sort of speckled pixel graininess in the dark spots. Now when I add the denoiser and run that shot again, you can see that a lot of that noise has been removed. It looks a lot nicer. It looks like I used proper lighting even though I didn't. Uh, this is actually a really nice thing that I can use for slow-mo shots if I mess the lighting up or if I try to shoot without my nice big soft box light. And this is just something that I wanted to pick up, cost about $100, and it's gonna let me have nicer footage for the channel to make videos for you guys. Just something I wanted to share. I think it's pretty cool. Hope you guys are having a good day, and I will see you tomorrow with my full review of Godspeed Deluxe Edition.